Sneak and tie stylish compound, steal something, Abby. Sneak, steal? No, sir, this is my taxi. Will you shut up there? Now, why are they spit on me? Now, you they spit on me. Hi, guys, and welcome back to Wako's Review, the only Nigerian YouTuber that raps. Cocaine! So if you are new here, please subscribe, turn on post notification so you'll be notified whenever I post. Like this video and okay, roll intro! What did you think it was? Before I review any show, I asked myself some series of questions and these questions, they range from different places. It goes from, is the story good? Is the acting good? Is the cinematography also good? And most importantly, do they have fine girls? Because this won't work if they don't have fine girls. I remember a month ago, I made a video titling this show The Darkest Web Series and how excited I was when I heard it was getting a live adaptation. And then I asked myself the same essential questions. Are the ladies fine? Because I can't do this anymore. The ladies have to be fine. So the people from the Naked Convos channel posted two episodes and I'm here to tell you what happened so far. So yeah, this is the video you're supposed to be watching. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> can I can I hear yeah from the back? Yeah. In episode one titled Genesis, it started with our main character as Aziz, Aziz, Aziz. <laughs> This is like the easiest name and I'm finding it hard to pronounce. Wow, we're starting well. It's there with Aziz entering a house just after knocking at the gate and from nowhere he gets hit by this rod or stick. If someone hits you with this thing, it slides out. We are going straight to heaven. But after getting hit, we see him and the girl we don't know in the middle of nowhere and they get shot. They then did this 24 time thing. Remember that show? Remember that show that had that time thing doing tang, tang, tang. And the first scene we see when he went back in time was him not feeling happy because his mom is not feeling fine. Then his friend was like, don't be angry, it's just diabetes, don't worry, no cut off just one leg. He then goes to his uncle to ask for money to treat his mom and instead of his uncle giving him money that he needed urgently, his uncle went another route and gave him a car and told him that he could at least use this for his transport business and his only rule with his car was do not drive at night. And guess what happened that same day? He drove at night. Outlaw! Then that night, this babe named Cassie entered his car with her friend and told him to take her to the island. And this is where his life turned upside down. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> <laughs> they go on the journey and the ladies start talking and this their gist was just so enticing that he had to poke his nose. Because that's what Nigerians do. We poke our nose. You think you can talk about your personal issues outside without someone putting their nose inside your business? What do you think you are? Eh? It's our business now. They get to the location and this Cassie girl pulls the biggest heist I've ever seen. So, you still wait for us because you take us to here, yeah? Uh-uh, no, no. Don't worry. Okay. I've only seen this tactic used with guys when they want a favor from their fellow guy, but they don't want their friend to say yes or no. Oh, bro, bro, can I, can I wear your shirt today? No, wait, I want to wear it. Thank you, bro, thank you, bro, I'm ready wearing it. Oh, bro, bro, can I sleep with your wife today? What? Thank you, bro. I've already started. He starts waiting for these babes that are obviously prostitutes. That's obvious now. That's obvious now. Should I have to say thing? That's obvious now. He knocked at the gate of the house that the girls entered and he gets approached by area boys. And at this point, I feel this guy should stop knocking or entering gates because every time he uses one, something bad happens. Every single time. He gets harassed by the area boys because they thought he was a thief. And the ladies had to come to his rescue. And I love, I actually love how you can see him try so hard to regain his pride here. Yeah? But it was too late. Let's go, please. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I hope they didn't hurt you. Don't mind these guys. You just give them small power and they want to over exact it. It's too late. They told him to take them to this club or bar. It can be both. The name is Coffee. Before leaving, they gave him a whooping sum of 20,000 naira so he would stop nagging and dry and that was how episode one ended and this is why i feel i'll be reviewing this show every two episodes dun, 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 dun. episode two titled motion moved continued from where it stopped with the nightlife i was really concerned here because this lady here got slashed with a knife and just took it like a champ she was like i'll walk it off i'll walk it off it's just <laughs> It's just a knife. Then the Cassie chick brought this white man into his car and they started having coitus, 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 
Kotosis. Kotosis. Did they even have sex, to be honest? I don't know. But if they did, that was very fast. Um, you might actually want to see a doctor, I think. Tell me what the doctor said also, please. These guys here are not the only characters. We also have this man named George. He's a disgruntled political candidate that after spending so much money on trying to be the local government chairman, that position was taken and given to someone else because this is king of boys, remember? So he decided to go on this war, this political war, political party war, infinity war. Then we see who is fighting or better still, who won the heart of the party named Otumba. He is rich and I actually like that because what I'm about to tell you now is so funny. It is so funny. You're about to laugh. Watch. His entrance into his show was him breaking his phone because someone called him. Then he walked to the other landline and he was a he threw the phone. He broke the phone. Um, he did not do that. He gets told here that his party chose him instead of George and he was concerned. He was like, oh, what of George? What of George? Then this man said, he wasn't happy at all, oh, chief. Uh, but uh, kill him, uh, what <laughs> are you doing? The show is shaping up to be good and we know it's a story of a guy that is literally the breadwinner of his home. With all those issues on his mind, he's now pushed into this nightlife. Not because he likes clubbing at Dev, Dev, David, what is the name of that thing? But he's doing this because his mom needs him to provide because she's sick. My expectations for the next two episodes is this Cassie chick is up to no good. She's obviously going to do a lot of things. I got my eyes on her. And I also feel the show might end up with him dying. And why I'm saying this is because, first of all, it's a very dark show. And I actually stopped listening to the podcast because I wanted to go in knowing nothing about the end. So that's why I am here with you guys. I don't know what's going to happen in the upcoming episodes. So please, if you guys do me a favor, drop your expectations down in the comment section. Do you like the show? Do you hate it? Drop it down in the comment section. And guys, is this Dev or David? <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, I'm really excited to, I don't know, review this show because I don't know, I like it. It's at first I thought I wouldn't like it, but I actually do. I love the commercials that they put in the mist because it gives this, it gives this satirical view. Or oh, I don't know. Am I even speaking English? It's sure in my alley. I like it. My question of the day is. What's your favorite um, song at the moment? What's your go-to song? Now, every time you, you put on your phone and you're like, let me listen to a song, you jam that song. Tell me down in the comment section. Don't be shy to destroy the subscribe button if you're new here. Like, punch it in the neck. <laughs> All right, so I guess I've been talking for too long. Please keep on being nice. My next video is on Spider-Girl and I'm only telling this to like the people who care because a lot of people don't reach this point so my next video is on spider girl keep it secret don't put it in the comment section at all thank you guys for watching we'll catch ourselves on the next one dab bye <laughs> i just dabbed nobody dabs in 2020 bye